Hello, my name is Chris Richter and welcome to Moodle at Rickshay. What I'd like to look at for you today is the course templates. Now, course templates is a clever little plugin. What it does is it allows you to create new courses based on a course template. What uh, often happens with people's courses is you create a course, you start using the course, and then you go, oh, we need another copy of this course to use for a new group of students and you duplicate it and then you have to clean things out and tidy it all up and then you move on with your new course. What you can do if you're really well planned is design your course, develop all the content, put it all together, create a template of that content and then any time that you need to recreate or duplicate that course you just go to course templates and you say create a new version of this course from our template and your course is created and you move on. Depending on the way that you develop courses, depends on how you go about this process. But let's have a look at the course template plugin. All we need to do is go to moodle.org, plugins, local course templates. I'll put that URL down the bottom for you. And you'll see here we have the course templates plugin. As an example, the course templates plugin just has an extra button that says use as a template for a course. To do this, we need to create a templates category or a course templates category, which is part of the requirement. So let's go ahead and do this. First of all, let's download course templates plugin. Let's head over to Moodle and we're now going to install our plugin. We are an administrator at the moment and so make sure your administrator to do this or ask your administrator to install it for you. Make sure you use the right version for your version of Moodle. Our plugin has been successful. Let's continue and continue. We've now installed our plugin. Let's go to Site Administration and Courses. Select Add a Category. We're going to create a category called Course Templates and Create Category. I have a course already created called Test 2. We're going to use this as a template for creating a new course. Let's go to Course Test 2, Edit Settings. This is our template course. So this is the course that we will use as a template to create a new course based on what this course currently exists as. So save and display. We now go to Site Admin, Courses, select Add a Course. And you'll now see a new panel called Course Templates. And course templates has in it test two. Any course that you create can be added to the course templates category and will appear in here. We're now going to use this as a template. Select use as template. Choose which category we'd like to put this in. This is one of our admin courses. So we will choose admin courses as the category. Select continue. This is test two, but it is our copy from a template. So we'll call it test two B. T2B and continue. We now have a new course created from our template test2. It's called test2B. We can now add all our new students to this course and move on very quickly without having to create a course from another course and clean out students or clean out any gradebook data or anything else like that. Really simple, straightforward way of managing courses where you are using a course template and then duplicating that course template for each of your classes or each of the groups of students that are using that particular course. It's been a short introduction on how to use the course template plugin. I hope that's been useful to you. If you uh, would like to know about some more of the top 10 admin tasks that a Moodle administrator should know about, click on the link below this video and I'll take you through how to clear a cache, how to run cron, how to set tasks, turning on debugging, reading log files, edit the config, run automated backups, check performance overview, check security reports, and how to use the ad hoc database queries. I hope this has been helpful. Please feel free to check out more videos on how to make the most out of the Moodle learning management system.